Hi lovely viewers, it's me again, your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. You have a heart condition, is that correct? <laughs> yes. In, in this heart, what happened? Um, I was traveling uh, for the games. There were international games, and then I was in the on the plane, and then I ate something. And since then, I came back to to the UK, and then they had to put the defibrillator. Something in your heart. They put it here. Uh, yes. You can see that there's something here. Yes. So this prevents uh, heart palpitations. My name is uh, Inok Mepu. I used to play football and and then suddenly uh, something happens, an attack came and I was pronounced that I can't play football anymore. It, it, it's hard really to, to really explain really what happened but what I can just say is that uh, um, in that situation or in that moment uh, I wasn't expecting it and, uh, and then just happened. It, it was a tough situation, tough moment for me, for my family, even obviously for 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 the fans. But at at the end of the day, I looked unto God and I just said, God, you are the one who made me. You are the one who gave me the talent. But all I know is that you cannot give me a talent and take it away. We met the the, the bond servants just through YouTube. We were watching some uh, sermons on YouTube, and then uh, I just checked on the. Uh, the name on the on the screen say tribe of uh, Enoch so I was really interested to, to look at that because my name is obviously Enoch you know I was so amazed by the revelation the, the teaching from the from the board servant of God it really uh, lifted my spirit and I wanted to now get to know more and more about him so I started watching more videos I that night the first night actually I watched I didn't even sleep I, I slept really late just watching these videos, these same ones, on and on and on, and it really lifted my spirit. We were never the same again. We kept on moving, and it, it kept on making us push more in terms of prayer. Yeah, especially when it comes to warfare, the spiritual part, and it changed our prayer points where um, we just used to pray like you know normally, but after listening to his sermons, our praying changed. <laughs> you know the wanted to go deeper in the realms of the spirit to start things of the spirit because he's he's based too much on the spiritual part you know where you go deeper you know where you meet up with the with god where you see jesus where you you know so we started praying our prayer point change and then we wanted to experience that kind of thing we were really uh, anxious to come and just fellowship and uh, and uh, have that view of, of of god's presence you know and now prayer was just that the Holy Spirit will locate us, the man of God should uh, at least pray for us and indeed uh, the Holy Spirit really located us. You have a heart condition, is that correct? Yes. In, in this heart, what happened? Um, I was traveling uh, for the games, there were international games. And then I was in the on the plane, and then I ate something. From a friend just gave me a sweet, uh -huh. and then from there I just collapsed and I had heart palpitations. Uh -huh. And then they had to wake me up. Okay, you you, you 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 collapsed. I collapsed, and then they had to palpitate me to wake up. Okay. And since then. And since then, I came back to, to the UK and then they had to put the defibrillator. Something in your heart? They put it here. Uh, yes. You can see that there's something here. Yes. You can see uh, uh, an iron here. Yes. So this prevents uh, heart palpitations.
Is it your husband? Yes. <laughs> Can you see that? He's out. The surgery is happening, but some of you did not even see it. Two angels came. They opened his heart, took away the damaged one, and replaced it. See, he's he's out. <laughs> Truly, he was poisoned. He was poisoned. Look at this man. Come see that. There's a tear coming out. Look at that. He can't even see. See that? It's gone. He's back. Come here. <laughs> How do you feel? Feel better. Feel better. Yeah. Why cry? It's been it's been a tough time, Papa. For me and my wife. It's been a tough time. I'm a football player and I had to retire because of this. Oh. Now are you you going back? Bless you. You're free. Amen. You need to go back. Ask them to remove that. Uh, I agree. To, yeah. Yes. You're free and uh, no no palpitations anymore. Amen. Thank you. Yeah. We have been faithful. We have been trusting God. We have been trained and we have been seeking Him diligently every day. And I was just happy that the bond servant has really uh, has really touched me uh, today. I know that uh, my prayers have been answered at just that moment. And uh, yeah, he touched me and uh, he said, "Look into my eyes." When I looked into his eyes, I saw like eyes that like changing. I don't know how I can ex I can express it like an ego eye like that. You know, an ego eye can see like oh. That's how we, when I looked into his eyes, they would change. And from there, I was like, couldn't see, I couldn't look much into his eyes. And then from there, it touched on my hand. And that's how I like blacked out a little bit. That's how I even fought down. And uh, from there, I just left. I was powerless. But it was amazing, really, that he touched me. And I believe my healing has come. I want to thank my wife, who really gave me hope and, and encouragement. To, to be strong and to stay faithful that this is just a process uh, we have to believe that God has a better plans for 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 you and uh, for those who really would want to learn from my situation I can also advise them that prayer really can make your life better because if you don't pray or you sleep the enemy will come and uh, might take uh, the blessings that God has put on uh, upon your life. So this situation is just uh, it's just that I'm I'm in that wilderness and God is just pruning and purging me. But uh, when I come back, I'll be I'll be a star that everyone will see. Alright, that's all for you today, lovely viewers. If you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below.
tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. Once again, I go by the name of Mutatim Pondum. I love you. Peace. I gotta go.